A transistor is a fundamental building block of modern electronics. It is a type of semiconductor device that can amplify and switch electronic signals. The basic function of a transistor is to control the flow of electric current between two points by using a third terminal called the gate. The gate is used to control the flow of electrons between the other two terminals, known as the source and the drain. By applying a voltage to the gate, the flow of current between the source and drain can be either allowed or blocked. Transistors can be made from various types of semiconducting materials, but the most common types are made from silicon. They come in different forms, including bipolar junction transistors, BJTs, and field effect transistors, FITs, which include metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistors. MOSFETs, and junction field effect transistors, CHFETs. Transistors have revolutionized the field of electronics by enabling the miniaturization of electronic devices and the creation of integrated circuits. They are used in a vast range of applications, including computer processors, memory chips, amplifiers, switches, and sensors. In summary, Transistors are a critical component of modern electronics, allowing for the control of the flow of electrical current through semiconducting materials. They have enabled the development of miniaturized and highly efficient electronic devices, and their applications are widespread across various fields. The 2N2222 is a bipolar junction transistor, BJT that is widely used in electronic circuits for switching and amplification. It was first introduced in the 1960s and has since become one of the most popular transistors due to its low cost, high reliability, and versatility. The 2N2222 is manufactured using NPN, negative positive negative, technology, which means that it has a layer of P-type semiconductor sandwiched between two layers of N-type semiconductors. This type of construction makes the transistor easy to control and operate. The 2N2222 has three terminals, the emitter, the base, and the collector. The emitter is the negative terminal, the base is the control terminal, and the collector is the positive terminal. When a small current is applied to the base terminal, it allows a much larger current to flow from the collector to the emitter, making the transistor a great amplifier. The maximum collector current that can flow through a 2N2222 is typically around 600 milliamperes, with a maximum power dissipation of 625 milliwatts. The transistor can handle a maximum voltage of 30 volts between the collector and emitter. The 2N2222 has a gain, which is the ratio of the output current to the input current, ranging from 100 to 300. This makes it an ideal transistor for low power amplification, switching, and linear voltage regulation. The transistor can be used in a variety of circuits, including audio amplifiers, LED drivers, voltage regulators, and switching applications. In addition to the standard 2N2222, there are also several variations of the transistor, including the 2N2222A which has slightly different electrical characteristics and a higher current rating, and the 2N2907, which is a complementary plug-and-play transistor to the 2N2222 and is commonly used in amplification and switching circuits. In summary, the 2N2222 is a widely used bipolar junction transistor that is popular for its low cost, high reliability, and versatility. It has a maximum collector current of around 600 mA, a gain ranging from 100 to 300, 
and is commonly used in low power amplification, switching, and voltage regulation circuits. The 2N2222 transistor has several electrical characteristics that determine its behavior in electronic circuits. These include collector current, IC. This is the maximum current that can flow between the collector and emitter terminals when the base current is sufficient. For the 2N2222, the typical collector current is 600 milliampers. Base current, IB. This is the current that flows into the base terminal and controls the flow of current between the collector and emitter. The typical base current for the 2N2222 is 15 to 20 milliampers. Collector emitter voltage, VCE. This is the voltage that can be applied between the collector and emitter terminals without damaging the transistor. The maximum VCE for the 2N2222 is typically 30 volts. Gain. This is the ratio of the output current to the input current, also known as the DC current gain or beta, I circumflex squared. The typical gain for the 2N2222 is between 100 and 300. Power dissipation, PD. This is the maximum power that the transistor can dissipate as heat without being damaged. The maximum power dissipation for the 2N2222 is typically 625 milliwatts. Transition frequency, FT. This is the frequency at which the transistor's gain starts to decrease, and it transitions from an amplifier to a switch. The typical transition frequency for the 2N2222 is around 250 MHz. Base emitter voltage, VBE. This is the voltage that must be applied between the base and emitter terminals to turn on the transistor. The typical VBE for the 2N2222 is around 0.7 volts. The 2N2222 transistor's characteristics make it well suited for a variety of applications, such as low power amplifiers, switching circuits, and voltage regulators. Its high gain, low noise, and low power dissipation make it a versatile and reliable choice for many electronic projects. Advantages of the 2N2222 transistor include Low cost The 2N2222 transistor is a low cost device that is widely available, making it an economical choice for many electronic applications. High reliability The transistor has a high mean time between failures, MTBF making it a reliable and durable component in electronic circuits. Versatility, the transistor can be used in a wide variety of applications, including amplifiers, switching circuits, and voltage regulators. High gain, the 2N2222 transistor has a high gain which makes it an ideal choice for low power amplification applications. Low noise. The transistor has a low noise figure, making it suitable for applications that require low noise. Disadvantages of the 2N2222 transistor include Limited power handling. The 2N2222 transistor has a limited maximum collector current and voltage, which restricts its use in high power applications. Temperature sensitivity, the transistor's electrical characteristics can be affected by changes in temperature, which can impact its performance in some applications. Limited frequency response, the 2N2222 transistor has a limited high frequency response, which makes it unsuitable for use in high frequency applications. Requires biasing. The transistor requires a bias voltage to be applied to the base terminal to control its operation, 
which can make circuit design more complex. Despite these limitations, the 2N2222 transistor remains a popular and widely used component in electronic circuits due to its low cost, high reliability, and versatility. The 2N2222 transistor has a wide range of practical applications and uses in electronics. Some of these include amplifiers. The transistor can be used to amplify signals in low power audio and radio frequency applications, such as in small audio amplifiers or oscillator circuits. Switching circuits. The transistor can be used as a switch to turn on or off electronic circuits, such as in LED drivers or relay control circuits. Voltage regulators, the transistor can be used to regulate voltage levels in power supplies, such as in linear voltage regulators. Digital logic, the transistor can be used in digital logic circuits as a switch or to amplify signals such as in and or nor gates, oscillators, the transistor can be used as a component in oscillator circuits, such as in simple relaxation oscillators or phase shift oscillators, electronic toys and gadgets, the transistor can be used in various electronic toys and gadgets, such as audio amplifiers, lead flashes, and simple robots, overall, the 2N2222 transistor is a versatile and widely used component in electronics, and its low cost and availability make it a popular choice for hobbyists and professionals alike. Its applications and uses are limited only by the imagination of the designer.